Well, the rain kind of threw off what I was going to do. So I decided I'd sit here and do another video on uh, some snacks that I have. So I went and bought these snacks. This pub mix from uh, Costco last week. To leave in the truck. And uh, pretty good. A little savory little mix. It's got your typical, you know, pretzel sticks, the sourdough chips, the rye chips, a few other things in there. I'm not sure what they are. But there's two things in there that are absolutely driving me crazy, and I don't know what they are. One of them looks like something you would hang in the in your bird cage and let your parakeets eat on it, and the other thing, I don't know what it is. It's it's got no flavor in it. It's like how do you have something in a in a in a savory pub mix that's got salt like crazy in it, and you got this one and ingredient or not ingredient is one piece of, of in there that has no flavor and we'll start with the no flavor thing first this right here has no flavor and I don't know what it is I can't figure it out it's got no flavor it's crunchy it looks like it has should have a lot of flavor but it has no flavor I've been eating them as filler, and it really doesn't bother me too much because of the lack of flavor. Crunchy, you know, and no flavor. I don't get it. I'm not even sure what it is or what it's supposed to taste like, but it's fine. It's a filler. It's okay with the pretzel sticks and the sourdough chips and the rye chips and the sourdough sticks with the two different flavorings on the two different ones in there. It's fine. There's some other things in there. I'm not sure what they are, but they have flavor pretty good. But then we'll get to the, the bird snack thing. This, I don't know what this is supposed to be. I have no idea what this is supposed to be. Like I said, it looks like some kind of bird snack. Something you would hang in the cage for your, your birds to eat. Um, looks like it has seeds in it. It's crunchy. It's puffy. But it tastes nasty. I mean, this 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 is tastes terrible. I ate, I ate a few of them just to make sure I didn't like have a bad one, kind of like you get a bad peanut or something like that. But it wasn't the the oddball bad peanut. It just tastes bad. And it's like how does it have this this horrible taste? I mean, I, I can't even describe what this tastes like. It imagine. Um, you wet some cardboard, you let it dry out, then you wet it again, let it dry out, and sprinkle some salt on it, and then ate it a month later. I mean, I think that's what this tastes like. It just, it's got a crunchy texture to it like everything else in there, but it's just, it just tastes bad. And I, I, I don't know what it is. And I, I looked on the, I looked on my, my pub mix here. And because I, I took it out of the out of the package it was in, I imagine the, the packaging it came with had what everything is, but it's not actually on this individual container. So I think I threw away the wrapping, so I can't even go back and find out. I have to probably go to Costco and you know maybe read the ingredients on on the pack and see what that bird crappy, terrible tasting crunchy nonsense is in here and figure out what it is because it's terrible it's terrible it's, it's bad you just ugh. I, I don't get it why you put this one and there's a lot of these in there it's like hey we got these bad tasting things in this experiment we had and nobody likes them. we got to get rid of them hey let's mix them in with our pub mix and get rid of them because this is like literally probably makes up a third of what it is eh, maybe a quarter I'm probably exaggerating probably probably a quarter and, and, it, and it's terrible. I don't get it. Um, it's not a make or break for my pub mix because I think it costs for that. I, it was like eight bucks or ten bucks. I can't remember what it is. They're pretty good. That's what I've been snacking on instead of going to the store every time I want to snack. Because I was getting other ones from the gas station, and they were probably like I think four ounces or whatever. And they're like three bucks. And this thing right here is like a hundred times the size, and and. Cost-wise, this is a lot better, you know. So it's not a make or break. I'll probably buy the thing again. 
but I already know to just completely bypass the the funky bird dingle dangling thing and it tastes terrible that's crunchy with salt it's just bad I don't I don't get oh god I mean give me give me the flavorless thing in there over the the the, the terrible bird treat but anyway so I've been riding around with this big old you can see it <laughs> big old container of uh, crunchy mix and uh, it's just part of my my deal I'm just trying to spend the least amount of money at, during the day by buying stuff from gas stations to snack on or going to the store because I think it's really expensive really fast so uh, right now I'm gonna enjoy my little rain break right now because I can't do what I was gonna do and I'm gonna eat some of my pub mix with my water that I mix with the uh, uh, flavoring and sit here and enjoy this rain that we're getting that we need badly. I just it needs to just keep raining for like a month straight. Actually, the snow is more important. But anyway, savory pub mix. Um, I like it. I know people that don't like them, but I do. Except for this terrible bird snack thing. That's God. Ugh, I mean. You had, they had to put work into making this nasty. The person who came up with this idea, I hope they're fired. Whoever it was, they should be fired. Because, or at the very least, put on some kind of probationary period. Because this thing is this is not happening. This this is just really not happening. This is I can't get over how bad this thing tastes. So, with that said, I'm gonna enjoy some more of my pub mix in the rain here. Uh, for about five more minutes and then my break time will be over and then the next time I probably get to do something is during my lunch break where I will not be eating this thing So I'm gonna enjoy the rain if it's raining where you're at. I don't know, but uh, until next time pub mix way to go